Hello and welcome gorgeous Taurus to your weekly reading. Let's have a look at your cards and the messages that Spirit would like to bring through for you. Be sure to connect in with your own intuition throughout the reading. This is how Spirit speaks directly to you of course. Just take what resonates and leave what doesn't resonate. Let's take a look here at your first few cards. It's time to simplify your life. You've had so much going on that you're spread too thin. This has to change now so your vitality can recharge. So I'm seeing a huge shift, Taurus, toward a blessed outcome where you are not so burdened, where you are not so tired, where you are not so weighed down, where things are more simple, things are simplified, there's a detox, there's a purification, there's a removal of the old and it is going to make way for new energy. You've had so much going on or so much on your mind recently that the energy has to shift and it will shift for the positive. You need to take the first step. Breaking down this problem into tiny pieces makes it easy to take the first step. So you might be contemplating doing something, saying something. You might know that Spirit's talking about a particular area of life here where you have been taking baby steps. Maybe there's a need to take another step forward rather than staying where you are. Saying yes to that offer. Moving into a newness. If there has been a breakdown in a relationship, Spirit is saying that things are going to get easier. You're going to have healing. You're going to have new things that start to become obvious. You're ready to take the first step in a new direction. It's time to raise your vibration. And you'll know if Spirit is talking about this energy for you have you been flat depressed have you been sad have you been in a, a tense vibration a frustrated vibration have you been in a situation a relationship or in the workplace for example where you're you haven't been able to raise your vibration because of the situation there will be changes and shifts in regard to this your intuitive feelings are accurate they are accurate messages from the angels. Listen to your intuition. Listen to your heart. You're going to receive intuitive nudges. You do have a bright future, so stop worrying. Everything is going to be fine. Spirit knows that you've been mentally anguished that you've been mentally stressed about an outcome or about a situation. Everything is going to be fine. You do have a bright future. Spirit is wanting you to really know that. It's time to step out and be bold. Unleash your adventurous side. Take risks and be daring. I feel this is connected to the energy of taking the first step or continuing to make small steps in the right direction for you. You might feel inspired to take adventurous action or make some choices in alignment with uplifting your vibe, uplifting your vibration. And it might be adventurous, it might be outside of the box, it might be different for you. Trying new things. Take risks and be daring. Past life, um, now this energy is about someone you have been in contact with in this life, someone from a long time ago. So they're going to reach out to you or you'll be thinking on them or they'll be coming through to you in some way. This situation involves your past life memories. Like I said, it doesn't feel to me like this is past life. This actually feels like it's someone in this life that you have known, but maybe lost touch with. There is no need to worry as everything is working out beautifully. So we have another card speaking of stop worrying. There is no need to worry. Be aware of where you're 
mental space is at. Spirit wants to bring through peace and harmony and ease into your life this week. So be aware of where your thoughts are at, Taurus. Heightened intuition, you had this message with the raising of your vibration, your intuitive feelings are accurate. You do have heightened intuition. You will get a feeling about something or someone. So pay particular attention to your feelings, your intuition, your heart. Be extra aware of your inner knowingness. It is trustworthy. It is going to show you the right way to do something. It's going to show you the answer. Revealing your true self. As you allow others to know the real you, you'll feel loved for who you truly are. So there's a, a connection that has been made or will be made soon and you will be able to be the real you. You'll be able to feel safe and comfortable with this person and truly loved for who you are. A beautiful connection. Spiritual path. Your true beliefs are becoming clearer to you, which prompts you to make necessary life changes this card is about becoming in alignment with your true self, your true path, and you will make changes if things are not in alignment for you. If things are not working for you, you're going to, you are going to consciously make decisions to bring you into alignment. The energy of giving birth, I am bringing forth new and dynamic energy into the world. You are giving birth to a new situation. It's a newness. It's a freshness. Taking the first step, going back to this card here, could be related for you. It's an exciting time. There is something new happening. And um, you might, in fact, be breaking barriers or having a breakthrough. I'm expanding beyond limitations into joy and freedom. A beautiful energy, Taurus. You are breaking barriers. You are breaking. I want to actually say you're removing obstacles. You're moving beyond challenges. Accepting what is. I accept and embrace my inner majesty. There's something you have to accept in a situation and you'll know exactly what spirit is talking about here for you. It's a very personal message for someone I feel. Guidance for Taurus, please, Spirit. The Nine of Michael is about worry. So we have this message again coming up for you. It's so important to, to know and understand and to release any negative thoughts. Your worry is unnecessary. Focus your thoughts on the outcome you desire. Release feelings of regret, guilt or worry to your angels. Time to release those thoughts. The moon energy. And this is a Pisces that you may have in your life. The opportunity to improve your plans. Listen to your intuition for accurate guidance. Face your fears and grow stronger. A new emotional situation is coming up for you. You may be in that energy right now. Messages regarding relationships or social invitations and great intuitive insights. There's going to be um, positive news. There's going to be a positive news that bring through a new emotional situation that you're very happy with. Maybe new social interactions or relationships can be formed. Nurture yourself and those you love. The ability to make everything more beautiful, practical and wise advice. So this week, just be practical and use your wisdom, use discernment in your judgments, in your decision making you can make your life more beautiful you can make a situation more beautiful the ace of michael a wonderful new idea don't allow bumps in the road to hinder your progress which i'm seeing you're not i'm seeing you're not the only thing that has come up again and again in this read is your thought patterns your beliefs your worries that could hinder your progress perhaps Clear up communication problems with others. That may also be a focus or it needs to be a focus with someone this week. 
joy through spiritual growth, focusing on your meditation, focusing on your spirituality is going to lift you higher, is going to lift your vibration, going to lift you into more positivity, but also situations will flow from that. Positive situations will flow from that. Be a light to others and answers that come through meditation. Beautiful. Let's take a look at the pendulum. If you have a question you'd like to ask Spirit through the pendulum, you are welcome to think of that question now. And the answer is yes. So check in with your intuition. See if this answer resonates with your question. You can trust your instincts. It's been wonderful to read for you today. Take care, stay blessed, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye for now.